Hola motivators and hello to our newcomers here. Welcome to the familia. And if you like anything beauty or makeup related, uh, you're in the right place. If you like anything on YouTube and you just like watching videos, you're in the right place. And hello, hola. It's nice to have you here with us today. And the video that you're watching today is gonna be about new makeup releases. And if you don't know who we are, Motivate the Earth is a beauty news Instagram outlet uh, sharing anything that is new about makeup. Um, if you haven't heard of brands, finding new brands, uh, giving you news about upcoming brands, uh, that is on our Instagram with all our information there too, uh, pictures, videos, things like that, and we do tutorials here on YouTube. Uh, we show you new makeup we've purchased ourselves or if we have gotten it in PR, stuff like that. And um, just a bunch, we like to do multiple looks here. We do um, want to start doing the panning. And our makeup can literally, and that's, we share makeup, can fit on a small little white desk, which is like right here in front of me. So uh, we are very much, um, watchful of what we purchase and sharing you like makeup releases like a will I buy it like kind of helps like get a second opinion or a third opinion and look at it and be like do I really need this or I know I know I want to if I could I would purchase like everything that looks good to me but I cannot but I would like to share that information with you uh, just to you know see start a conversation here like if you like something let me know in the comments if you don't like what I like who cares? It's just makeup. Just let me know. Come on. But we're going to be sharing new makeup releases and dabble in a little bit of our thoughts. Um, if you want to know everything that's coming out or that's newly released, then keep watching. If I'm looking to the side, I'm looking at my notes. Okay? I'm looking at my notes. So, the first uh, brand I have to talk about is Fantasy Cosmetica and they came out with a Rogue palette. And this came out March 1st, uh, which it's already out and it's sold out. But there's a pre-order up and it says that that is going to be shipped in two to three weeks. Not only did they release that, they released uh, the Magnetic Palette Shades Matte and Multichromes. Matte is $4.99, Multichromes is $9.99, and the palette was $38.99. Um, and then they released perfumes with it, which are 10 milliliters, $16.99. So I wasn't interested really in the perfume, to be honest, because I have perfume I need to finish. and. I don't know I have to like really smell it in person because I like certain things but honestly I just like stuff that's like I don't know it smells good to me vanilla maybe I love vanilla Vanilla's a good smell to me I feel like smelling like vanilla is like that's how I should smell <laughs> I don't know but I did <sighs> looking at that palette like look looks so delicious I had to get it here it is and it's on my eyes because I will have a video up with multiple looks and my thoughts on this, but look at this inside, like, come on, like the shades in there really intrigued me, I'm into those shades, um, especially the packaging too, I like it, it feels weighted, um, and looking at it too, on the pictures, you know, it does, those pictures did do it justice, um, and I, I like anything really that has purple but I gave in because the whole mix, I felt like the whole color story really drew me in and I didn't see repeating shades. And I got it, I got it, yes. Are you gonna get it? Did you like that color story? Let me know, let me know. Next brand is Glamlight. Now there's a sneak peek here of Hershey's Glamlight collab part two. So, oh, let me move to the side a little bit. So. Uh, Glam, they just did a little sneak peek that we found um, and we had to share it because I am very much intrigued by what Glamlight does uh, now because I got this Scooby Doo Glamlight collab and I enjoyed it so much like it really like now I'm like really looking at Glamlight and um, like wanting to purchase from them like a little bit more. I had a good experience with the Glamlight Scooby Doo collaboration so very much looking into that. Hershey's part two. Uh, I think I wasn't interested in the first one, but um, let's see how I feel once the little sneak peeks start rolling in, which we'll be sharing that on our Instagram. So this is kind of like maybe for now until I see like all the color stories and what they're going to drop. Like, well, I don't know. I mean, because the 
too. I'm a sucker for packaging and they always have great packaging as well. Uh, so it's definitely a brand I'm looking out for. Uh, next is Essence uh, Makeup. They released um, like a little collection. It says available in March, but I haven't seen anything uh, which we updated on the Instagram too is I haven't seen anything yet like that it's available. And they have like an eyeliner brush, um, a glow stick, a mattifying stone roller, a makeup sponge, blush lighter, um, an eyeshadow and eyeliner palette. So I don't know, and a makeup sponge. I like the color of this. Um, now the price for Essence to me is uh, a great price for me. I don't know if it's a great price for you, but Essence usually is a great price for me. The uh, thing is, I don't know, I like the color, but it's like the products aren't really drawing me in, you know? And so I don't think I'm going to pick this uh, collection up, really. Uh, maybe if other people use it, but still, like, it's not, like, drawing me in, not making me double take, you know? So the next brand is Adept Cosmetics. Now, I'm very surprised because... This is just a restock of their 63 pen magnetic palette, um, but it's only $25. And that's USD. Whatever I'm talking about here is USD dollars. 63 pen palette, like a magnetic palette, $25. I feel like that is a great deal. Um, and if I have a lot of single shadows, which I plan on getting more single shadows from different brands, but I don't have a lot of single shadows right now. Like if I had a bunch, like this, I see a lot of people have a bunch. I would get these because they're just like so huge and um, it's $25. I feel like it's a great, I feel like I've seen a lot more expensive ones like from other brands. I don't know, I just thought it was a good uh, deal so I, I end up sharing, I'm sharing it with you now but uh, if you ever shop at Adept Cosmetics too, you can use code EARTH, it is affiliated. Any links or codes down below that you use, like we really do appreciate it, it helps us keep going. We have full time jobs and this is a passion of ours too. Um, we love makeup, love to share it, like, seriously, if I could do this all day, I would, <laughs> but your girl's gotta go to work. <laughs> um, so, alright, so the next brand is an unearthly eight-piece, uh, complexion brush set. Okay, I don't know what it is, but that orange for unearthly, uh, and if you're gonna shop at unearthly cosmetics, you can use our code EARTH, it's affiliated, whatever you purchase to get a discount. Um, so when I saw that, I'm like, wow, that orange on, I don't know, I, I like that orange contrast. I thought that was a great release. Um, then they had a not in the mood waterline, waterliner palette for $30. So that eight piece blush com or brush, uh, com oh my gosh, can't even talk. That eight piece complexion brush set was $35, but it, and it came with a bag. Um, and then the Not In The Mood Waterliner Palette is $30 um, and they have the art, uh, and that was Serendipity art that's on there. I don't know if that art necessarily goes with the palette, but I like the art. Like I saw some people say that it doesn't go with the palette or they're not into the art, but I like, I'm, I like the art. <laughs> I like the packaging. It looks pretty cool. Um, I'm just into that art. People are probably not a fan of that art, but I am. Um, I do like the eyeliner hot split pan, giving you split pan, giving you more colors to work with. And it's only thirty dollars. I feel like I don't know why, but those liners are like kind of expensive when I look at other places. Um, the water liner, and I like that these are all like there's a bunch with split pans. I thought it was a great price for this. Definitely will like get this. Like this is so pretty to me, like the orange set and then the liner. But I think if I had a pick between the two, because I can be wasting all my money, is um, probably the water liner palette. I feel like I can do very creative looks with that. I've been looking for some more water liners. Because um, I did, did have some from um, Makeup a, Makeup a Murder Cosmetics. So, um, I did have some from like Makeup or Murder um, Cosmetics, which um, I was using. I like those, uh, but I'm looking for like more colors. A palette seems more convenient to me, but hey, Unearthly, that was intriguing. I like that launch. I think it goes good with like the launches they've been having. It's been consistent, but not too fast like Colourpop. 
I feel like ColourPop, like, well on tangent, but ColourPop is like, oh my god, I feel like some of their stuff is pretty, I'm like, oh, they keep launching it, and it's like, I don't even want to purchase it, because by the time I purchase that set, it's like old news, like, it feels like it's two years old, <laughs> I don't know, is that how you feel, I don't know. Um, the next thing is Sigma and Kristen Dominique. Um, it's a brush set for $105. Um, it's already available. Um, I thought it was kind of weird because Kristen Dominique has her own uh, makeup brand, but she's teaming up with Sigma for brushes. So, I mean, it's weird, but I like, I don't know why, but I'm, I'm like drawn to those brushes. I like the look of them. Um, I really want to try a lot of stuff from Sigma. I have yet to try anything from Sigma. Uh, for some reason, I always go in there. I'm like, oh, and I want to get some brushes, but then I end up not getting the brushes. So I'm really like want to make a purchase. Um, I think I'm waiting for like the right woman because the palettes lately haven't been drawing me near like to them, like drawing, catching my eye. You know what I mean? Like, hmm, what? Am I gonna buy you? Um, I don't know what it is, but I really want to get from them because I hear they have really great call wallet. <laughs> really great quality from the brushes so I'm I really want to get some brushes from there because I am needing an upgrade I have some old scratchy Morphe ones but I do have RT brushes AOA brushes um, definitely washing the year old brushes I think I also have like a Zoeva brush um, that's lasted a long time but I definitely am looking for more brushes so I feel like I would get this um, Again, this could be hypothetically because I can't, I don't have all the money, right? I uh, don't have all the money in the world um, and I'm trying to stop myself from buying things too. But if hypothetically speaking, if I could on my little budget get this, I would. Uh, so the next brand would have to be uh, Shall We Makeup or Shall We Makeup um, 12 Shades uh, Pressed Flakies, um, 18 dollars per piece yeah so shall we makeup it has um i'll show up some pictures here 12 shades and pressed flakies 18 uh usd dollars per piece uh with free worldwide shipping on march 8th only i see there's like acrylic magnetic palettes um the shades that they were swatching the shades that were in the palette is like they're so pretty i am like yeah they're catching my eye the acrylic that those palettes, like I don't know about C3 palettes, but the way it's like laid out, it, it really like something artistic like that catches my eye. But um, they look very beautiful. Like I really would like to get from that uh, collection. Um, we I think we do have a code. I'll pop it up if we do have a code with them. Uh, it would be code Earth for most of our stuff. But uh, other things we would let you know. Uh, but shall we? I mean, look at those sneak peeks. Like I really like the application. Um, the way that they're shining, like, oh, like, oh, I guess shiny things just draw you in, right? All right, so those are the makeup releases for number four new makeup releases here in 2023, and we'll have more up. Did you see any brands that you liked? Have you, did you not even know that these makeup releases existed, dropped? Um, definitely comment down below, let us know. Any other information will be on our Instagram. But if you liked anything here today, you like this video, definitely like, subscribe, comment down below any thoughts, any new ideas, or you just wanna have a conversation about makeup. All right, we love it. And uh, thank you so much for staying uh, with me throughout this whole video. Uh, I'll see you in the next one, and you have a great rest of your day, evening, weekend, vacation, anything, like whatever you're doing, have a great one. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Adios.